Metal Gear Solid, Peace Walker. Now, I'm going to warn you, the two words you'll be hearing most often are nukes and uh, freaking deterrence, okay? Just get ready. And it's going to be under a Cold War theme, so you know. An army without borders, 10 gamer score. Level up all my weapons, not nearly enough. I got an A. I probably wasn't fast enough for the other stuff. Now I unlocked a whole bunch of crap. How's that map, Snake? Think you can use it? No. It tells me where their bases are. You're gonna have to lead me. I'm blind. No rounds. I only have one I eye. I need better intel on the lay of the land. Snake, the professor said he's got the Sandinistas on his side. Said you should get in touch with the FSLN Commandante. Hmm. Do they know they're back by the KGB? Oh, <laughs> not yet. Nah. As far as they know, they're really fighting for the revolution. The KGB is staying behind the scenes. I'm not sure the Sandinistas are aware of what's really going well, on. Well, let's leave them in Still the dark. I can't believe anybody would bring nukes here. Yeah. That's a shocker. Costa Rica's party to the Tlatel Loco Treaty, which declares Latin America a nuke-free zone. Oh, well, fuck that Based treaty. Based three non-nuclear principles, advance the testing, use, import, or deployment of nuclear weapons. If word of this gets out, Openall will be forced to act. It'll cause an international uproar. The treaty was signed to prevent another Cuban Missile Crisis. If the U.S. itself is gonna scrap oh, it... Oh, fuck it. Latin America is too close to spawning another Cuba or two already. The entire continent would become one big powder keg. Well, if they did bring nukes, we can't let them get away with it. Are they planning a test? Showing off? Or is it all to keep the anti-American movement in check? Good question. Why bring them here? I can't figure it out. Whatever the CIA's up to in Costa Rica, the professor wants That's it right, to stop. fuck the Americans. We need to find out what that something is. We need to get ready first, Kaz. Repairs. Working as fast as we can, boss. This place is oh, they gave us a shithole. Like hell. But as long as you're with us, we'll make it heaven. No one can bother us here. No state telling us what to do. This is the MSF's haven. Our mother, mother base. base. This foothold, we'll back you up even better than before. We're gonna turn this pile of junk into something. Yeah, big. they did give us a shithole. How nice of the professor. Oh, please help us. We're gonna give you all the resources we can manage. Gives me a tiny little shithole off the coast. Oh, hey, look, they added stuff to the, uh, the loading screens. Welcome to MSF's Mother Base. Mother Base can support your mission in many different ways, from developing new weapons to collecting intelligence. And right now, I only have very few things, um, loaded, that is, that you can do. So I'm going to go ahead and just save the game. Storage device already contains, yes, overwrite. Right. R&D. This is how you develop new weapons. No, I don't need to view the tutorial. I know how. Alright, what do I need to unlock the better? I need an R&D level of 2 or higher to unlock the better suppressed pistol. How do I scroll through this? Here we go. New. No, they're not going to list anything. Alright. Can't do anything with it, really. Oh, they show the stats in the background. I never really noticed that on the PSP shitty graphics. You can never really tell. I have no money. Damn, man. I forgot what it was like to start off in this game with absolutely nothing. I don't need to view that. So right off the bat, I'm just going to basically summarize this extremely fast. What you do is you take all these different people who are part of MSF and you assign them to various rooms and whatnot that they can be used to further your weapons or your supplies or your food or what basically anything you can use in game so like for example as you can see here with this guy eagle ray he has five bars on the right side of the screen one looks like two swords that are crossed the other is a wrench um the other is a fork and a knife and then there's a pill and then there's i don't even know a radar sweep i guess that is so basically those refer to the different um, the different teams that he can be assigned to and how proficient he is in each team so for example as you can see here his wrench is his highest that means that his R&D which refers to the wrench skill it's incredibly good compared to I guess everyone else I have so for right now he would be best suited to work in my R&D team now I can unlock that pistol 
from before and the analyzer, which I never use. And now here's this guy. Once again, his wrench is pretty well, it's higher than all his other stats. So I'm going to again put him in the R&D team. We have another R&D capable dude, another one, another one. Now this guy's pretty rounded out, so I'm going to put him in my combat team. Which basically gives me money with which to research stuff. So again, you see this guy, his wrench is incredibly low. So put him in here. And there's more teams, but you have to play the game to unlock them. Whoa, I didn't even check this guy. Yep, put him in combat. Put him in combat. 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 This guy would go in the medical team, but I don't have it unlocked right now. Lungfish is his name. And now Miller, as you can see, he's a unique. Everyone else is a normal, as you can see. That means they're just a normal, standard person you can recruit. Miller, on the other hand, is a motherfucking god, okay? Look at his stats. He can go anywhere. He's not that really good at R&D or medical, but he's really good with combat, which is the cross swords. He's really good at cooking, which is the, uh, the, the knife and the fork. And he's, you know, pretty good at intel as well, which is the radar sweep. So for right now, I'm going to put him in combat, which is definitely going to raise my stats. Go to R&D, weapons. As you can see, I can now develop the Hush Puppy, rank 2. Very good. And now basically, in order to max out the Hush Puppy, or, but anyway, as you can see here, the way you increase how fast something is upgrading is what you do is you basically do what I did. You spent the GP to start the upgrade process, and then you go do a couple missions, however long it takes to fully max out the development time, and then you're good to go. And you can replay missions as often as you want. You can replay the same mission a dozen times. Oh, good, a R&D team of level 28 or better. What about this? R&D team of seven, I only have five. R&D team of 30, I don't even use grenades. Smoke grenade R&D team of seven, and you get empty magazines, which are basically used to create noise. A non-lethal shock weapon. Its strength increases the more it's used. Now, whoops. How about for items? Can I develop anything here? Ration rank two. Nope. I need the mess hall and then R&D team. So nope. And that's basically all I can do. So, damn, that actually looks pretty impressive. That screen right there. Pause Ortega! Select the mission you wish to participate in, and then use LT and RT to switch tabs. You can play co-ops by connecting to Xbox Live. To become the host, select the mission in the tab other than the co-ops tab. Uh, other missions can join from the host search, blah, blah, blah. So, for right now, I don't know, because I'm not upgraded at all, and when I played through this game the first time, it was really a real struggle, so I don't know, maybe I should actually consider doing co-op, and enlisting maybe one of my friends, who totally didn't inspire me to play this game, or beg me for several weeks to play this game, maybe I should invite one of them to join in and possibly help me out, because I have nothing, as you can see, I basically only have the Hush Puppy, and an M16 that's not nearly as powerful or in fact mine is actually silenced can you believe it or not in the P PSP version so I don't know for right now I'm not upgraded enough at all to do this by myself so I'm gonna enlist some backup and we'll be back